Okay, it's Saturday morning. It's about uh, 6.15 in the morning. Uh, I've come to the Piazza Escolino, which is near uh, Santa Maria Maggiore in front of me. Uh, one of the problems uh, of painting in the city is that you have to uh, deal with the elements that, uh, that are around you in the city. A lot of times you can't find peace and quiet. Uh, you have to deal with uh, the birds, the, the garbage, the traffic, uh, people coming up to you and talking to you. But um, I get up early in the morning and so I'm in the city when there are less people around. It's easier to paint. Um, I'm going to go around the piazza try to find a place that's comfortable to paint and beautiful to look at uh, in that order. First of all, it's most important that I can paint, that I can actually be in a place and paint. Secondly, it's important what I'm looking at because when the light starts, uh, right now you might be able to see just a little bit uh, over here to my left. Some of the buildings are starting to get a little bit of light, but uh, in a few minutes we'll be um, making a roundabout uh, view of the piazza. Okay, this is a very nice view uh, of the street and two of the towers the, of the church. Um, however, I'm right in the middle of a busy traffic intersection and probably will not be able to paint here. Okay, but I do take pictures of this. this piazza and really uh, at this point I haven't found anything extremely exciting. Now, uh, the alternative is to come to the front of the church which is the part that is more touristic. Uh, lots of tourists come here and will be in the front. Uh, however in the morning it's not a problem. The light is obviously more attractive. Uh, you get a view of, of the facade of the church, quite beautiful, and the light uh, eventually is going to put all of this into a very, very beautiful light. But once again, you have a problem with traffic. Uh, I'm going to walk around the piazza and try to get different uh, places, once again, looking for. Uh, the place to stand and to paint. That's the major objective here. to St. Mary's Major uh, to make my painting. I'm going to show 
uh, now how I set up and where I set up some of the things I think about. Uh, first of all, I finally decided on this view because uh, looking at the back side, there's just not, not a good place. Uh, this is a compromising place. Uh, let me show you. There is a busy intersection here and behind me uh, I'll have this traffic probably all day. ready because last time I painted so I've got that but I'll need to add fresh color uh, sometimes I scrape a little bit if I see that that uh, some of the paint has dried in the center zones of colors from warm warm to cool and then white over here So this is ready. I'm going to now add the colors. Okay, I'll need to probably add some orange, some yellow. This looks pretty hard. Uh, ochre color, yellow, yellow ochre. Uh, probably umbers, burnt umber, and. The greens. So I've got the colors uh, distributed here in the box so that I can easily just grab a color and add it to the palette. On the palette, there's a small quantity uh, of each color, and so that's that enables me to work. Uh, without thinking about grabbing colors. The thing that I wanted to point out was uh, the oil. Okay, I've got the oil in these little containers. Basically, I just use one, one container of this. I'm using a linen pre-bought Chinese uh, canvas today. It's not a big deal for me. I don't worry much about the quality. Uh, not for these sketches. Uh, I put the canvas as high as I can. Try to keep it level. And then I block this very, very well. Uh, then I put the canvas overlapping here so that I can paint right to the edge. And this on the top, so I just push this down and then I block the whole thing so that I've got a pretty tight hold on the, the canvas. I go now. Uh, I don't have any light yet. Uh, it's still very, very diffused light at the top of the building over there. But I'm gonna start sketching because I can get blocks of the buildings in, the ground plane, start working on this fountain, it's going to be difficult. Um, so I'll let you see the painting after it's done. Oh, it's about 8.30, I've been at it for about two hours. Uh, not a bad day, the sun came out, it uh, came directly on the 